Peggy 18. I spend more time alone than a lot of the other Marines. And I don't talk as much as most of them either. They're always showing pictures of their families. Laughing and joking to keep their minds off the realities of Tajikistan. Yeah, but a couple of the guys know why I don't participate in the reminiscing. I don't have too much good to reminisce about. I got very little family left, and I only have a few pictures to show. I understand, life is short. I also know a little something about loss. Loss has followed me everywhere I go. I hope for the sake of my brothers in the Corps that hasn't followed me here. We got enough to worry about without having to deal with my baggage. You know, sometimes, privately, I'm conflicted. I mean, I know the men we're at war against are trying to harm us, but I can't help but wonder who they leave at home. You know, a daughter, a son, a brother, a sister. Yeah, but I can't hesitate out there in battle. Because if I do, I put my team and myself at risk. And that is unacceptable. I've seen it happen before. You know, for, for one reason or another, you get a team member who is just a step slow. Or a moment too late. There are few second chances in Tajikistan. Judgment is instantaneous. And the consequences are harsh. The people I loved before I got here are gone. They're not coming back, but they live through me. In a lot of ways, those tragedies have served to protect me. I don't fear death the way that makes me nervous or anxious. I know we all have our time. You can't live your life scared. If you do that, you're not really living at all. <laughs> it's interesting. The most chaotic, unpredictable country on earth is the one place where I found the most structure and routine that I've ever had. I mean, I know where I'm supposed to be. I know my role, and most importantly, I know how to whip ass with my 203. And I guess, um, you know, the best I can offer the core is to do my job, stay focused, and never stop pushing forward. And if I get struck down in action, I just... I hope it happens while I'm doing something to better the cause of my fellow Marines. And maybe even save a life. Their families deserve that of me. <laughs>